The world has witnessed nearly 50 days of deadly Saudi airstrikes on the impoverished country of Yemen. Along with the continuous airstrikes and bombardment of civilians, Saudi planes and naval ships have imposed a blockade on Yemeni airports and seaports. Despite the blockade, a cargo prepared by Iranian NGOs as well as Iran's Red Crescent is setting sail to the war-torn country. Iran is sending 2,500 tons of humanitarian aid with this ship. The aid is being sent in association with International Red Cross and Red Crescent. The ship departed from the Iranian port city of Bandar Abbas and is now on the Sea of Oman heading southeast toward the Yemeni port of Hodeida. This is not the first time Iran is trying to deliver humanitarian aid to Yemen. Last month, Saudi Arabia prevented two Iranian civilian planes from delivering medical aid and food supplies to the impoverished country. Iran's aid convoy was supposed to be sent to Yemen by airplanes, but Saudi Arabia did not allow Iranian planes to land. Officials in Yemen and even Saudi Arabia have been informed about Iran's aid ship. Hopefully, there will be no problem in unloading the ship in its destination. In addition to the journalists and the crew, a band of international anti-war activists and a group of volunteer doctors are on board. I'm here on board of this ship, Iran Shahid, to make sure that the world gets to know, and help that the world gets to know, about the atrocities of the U.S.-backed Saudis in Yemen against the civilian population, against any law. It's a multi-criminal, brutal massacring of civilian people. The journey will take 7 to 10 days, and if the ship is allowed to dock in the destination port, the cargo will be delivered to Yemeni officials, Red Crescent, and Red Cross representatives. Reporting for Press TV, Mehdi Jamshidi, Sea of Oman.